Welcome back everybody. Hopefully you guys had a safe holiday and enjoyed the weekend. Just want to say thank you guys for the support and coming back for another video. So I got an update for you guys on the VPI IMG. We're going to be feeding the Burmese Python, Pop-Tart, and Mountain Dew. So that will be super exciting. We already have a lovely lady stretched out ready for some food. So there is peaches, Mountain Dew is already hungry, and then Pop-Tart is down below. So I tried to weigh Pop-Tart yesterday. Um, I have this little tiny scale that I've been um, kind of weighing some of the rats, and I don't even know where it is right now. It might not be in here, but it's very small like food uh, scale. So putting Pop-Tart on there was very difficult. I ended up getting a bigger tote like right here and putting her in there and then weighing the tote. So the tote weighed about two pounds and uh, with her in there it was right around almost 10 pounds. So Pop-Tart's right at, I would say right at eight pounds, which is ridiculous. She's a little over three years old. Uh, so she's definitely gaining some size, which is exciting and um, trying to find food for her is uh, a little difficult. So, the VPI IMG, this lady shed out yesterday, took her outside uh, for some pictures. You guys can look at that on the Instagram. And she looks really, really nice in the natural sunlight. A lot of uh, iridescence, just a lot of cool colorations coming out of her, even though she is just a uh, blackish and white snake. But man, she looks gorgeous. Outside and definitely just in the room with the uh, with the regular lights on. So she's a 2021. She came from Tony Antonini, which was Chi Town. I think it's Chi Town Constrictors, if that's uh, if I'm remembering correctly. But just a very nice docile snake. Uh, she can be a little bit nippy when she is in shed, but I didn't have any issues with her at all. Uh, during this process and she's basically on weaned weaned rats or rat pups so definitely glad she is out of the mouse stage and uh on the rats getting much larger so ooh, yeah we can check out the belly on her look at the belly really cool patterns and colorations so we'll just put her back and if she wants to go back there we go so this guy right here is still in shed. The eyes have come out of being super glossy, so we'll give him just a couple more days. Here are the meals for today. The big one is going to Pop-Tart. The other big one's going to the Berm. And then that one's going to Mountain Dew, which she should get two of those a week. And I really think, so I think that might be a little too large for her, because that's a, I think that's a medium. That's a jumbo. So the smalls we'll have to do for right now. The banana clown, or sorry, the banana pie is growing very nicely. She's a 2021, very, very late 2021. Getting a lot of size on her. Really cool markings, patterns, super uh, high expression, low white. But very excited to see what she has in plan. I really do wanna pair her with uh, possibly the mahogany pied or the orange stream leopard entry pied. We'll see what happens with that. Do you need to clean her cage, but she should be eating here very soon. And we will go ahead and not waste too much of your guys' time. And we'll go ahead and feed these. So she did have a rabbit the last feeding and that rabbit was shockingly looked very large but was not very big so this guy right here basically is the same size as that rabbit the rabbit was just had a very thick coat of uh, fur and i do have a two pound rabbit but oh, she's definitely hungry <laughs> but i'm really concerned that it, i think she would be able to eat the two pound rabbit but i do think the two pound rabbit would be um Oh, there we go. So this is definitely her biggest meal so far. Beautiful colorations on her. She is a pearl. So uh, that is the hypo and <clears throat> hypo and albino mix. <clears throat> and we'll feed 
Mountain Dew. And yeah, she's definitely getting some really good size on her. And she should be getting bumped up on a bigger meal. So anyways, for the two pound rabbit on Pop-Tart, that's really like 30% of her weight. So doable, yes. But um, I don't know, it, it just makes me nervous. So she's definitely knows her spoon around. So using all the precautionary, uh, you know, we want to be safe. So she's gorgeous. She's getting big, like I said, eight pounds, which is, I would say, I don't know, average. I don't know much about <laughs> the anacondas, but uh, I would say eight pounds is a good size for her for being a 2019 baby. So we'll try to bring some light over here. We'll try to get her out so we can actually see her eating. And we'll go from there. So this is a very large rat, but come on. And this is probably just like a snack to her. So there we go. We'll see what happens. She should eat it soon. She can be very weird on eating. She doesn't really have like a crazy feeding response. As she just <laughs> yanks that out of <laughs> the pliers. But uh, it's really not like any of the other snakes. So definitely a very, she's definitely thick. So this is my hand up against with her. And you guys see her quite often on social media anyways. I don't want to say she is my favorite, but uh, she does get spoiled. And we'll just watch them eat for now. And then we have to feed a lot of these snakes. We have to feed the snow, which we saw in the last video. We have to feed the motley, the IMG. This girl is gorgeous. And a lot of these snakes do now realize that there is food in the room, so I need to be a little bit cautious. The moon glow, which we saw her. I really do think the moons and the snows are probably one of my favorites. And then this beautiful lady right here. So this is the jungle hypo. It's a pastel, and I don't know what pastel line it is. Somebody asked me, and I, I don't know. I have to ask John. So got this lady from him. She's 2019 also. So she eats weans. She's just a very slow grow, but I love how bright the tail is on her. And who else do we want to see really fast? This is the banana clown. These look phenomenal as babies. Beautiful purples in them, beautiful colors. And uh, they do fade out a lot. I'm not saying they fade out for, uh, as being a bad thing because I think he still really looks good. And I'm really thinking I'm going to pair him to uh, this butter right here. So... Should be a cool combo. We'll have to see what happens with that. So, looks like this lady's already starting <laughs> to eat. So we'll just kind of hang out and watch what she does.
that is it. She ate very well. Did not get video of Mountain Dew over here, but she did eat very, very quickly. And then of course we saw uh, Peaches over here just devouring that large rat. And as you can see back there, uh, not much is showing. So I guess that's gonna be her her meal of choice from now on is just, she should be exploding in size soon. Got to clean out her cage. I hate Aspen. Now that Repti Chip has breeder uh, size bulk bags, I'm going to be buying some of that. So uh, stay tuned. And this Jumbo definitely kind of laid a uh, nice size in her. But uh, with that, thank you guys for watching the video. And I'll see you on the next one.